Hi, I'm Clover. Welcome back to my channel. Today I thought it would be fun to continue the long play series I started, focusing on kind of just doing whatever I want, making a really aesthetic farm, getting everything pretty. It's been a while since I last recorded, but I believe we left off with the flower dance. If you missed that, I will link the other two episodes up above, but you're perfectly welcome to just start here too. So let's get into it. I have so many strawberries. I also really need to get some more seeds because I dislike having all of those empty spaces. But it's the 25th, then I don't think anything will grow. Oh well. It'll just be a little bit of a mess until summer starts. I love the one flower that grew faster. It's so cute and so out of place and so awkward. I really like the suggestion to just leave all of the flowers once they're grown, so I think I'm going to do that. But for now, do I have any active quests? Mining and building a coop. Hmm. Let's go mining. That sounds fun. Always a good activity for a rainy day. Get some strawberry jam going. No, do not eat the strawberry. Yeah, mining sounds like a good idea. Do I have any food for it? Not that I'm willing to use, but it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Watch me regret this decision. Forage. Ooh, another leak. Linus, would you like a leak? Oh, I hate these levels. They're the worst. Because of that. Nope, I can't see it. Nope, nope. how I went. Oh, it's a bad luck day. Oh no. Let's go to the mines. That sounds fun. Although some of the days I go into the mines with bad luck, I end up finding so much. It just takes a while. Especially on these floors because I can't see. Ladder. Ooh. That's a good combo. Oh no. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm actually like really scared of bats in real life. So being swarmed by them in the dark levels where I can't see anything is not very fun. Oops. Nope. I did not make a good series of decisions for this, but... I'm alive. Ish. I'll just casually eat all of my forage. It'll be fine. It's not that far to the ice levels, right? That'll be helpful. Just kind of swinging blindly and hoping. Those things are the worst. I did not make a good decision. It's okay, I just need to get down one more floor and I can reasonably weave the mines. And then go do something calming and nice and fun. Not that this isn't fun, I just would prefer not to be attacked in the dark. I am such a wimp before I get the light rings. Like. Please give me a glow ring or whatever it's called. I forget. Is it a glow ring? A light ring? I don't know. It's the ones that make light. Okay, let's see. Where's somewhere vaguely lit up where I can look for a ladder? embarrassing. I thought it was a completely different square than it was. I 
I'm starting to feel exhausted. I need to get down one more floor. And I don't have any food. This was the series of choices. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Oh, you can continue to mine once you become exhausted? That's new. I didn't know that. Okay. I will accept this. You can only continue to mine for a little bit. Oops. At least I leveled up. <laughs> I did not expect to level up right then. Um, let's just pretend that didn't happen and go do something cute and calm and pretty instead of get lost in the dark and forget I need to eat and die. Yeah? <laughs> I'm actually very embarrassed that, that was the first day I recorded. Okay, series of bad decisions over. Let's not do that again. Let's go do something fun. Oh, let's go work on building a coop. It'll be very nice to have a coop, and then we can get chickens and come up with a naming theme. Which is always one of my favorite things to do. Okay, do not pick any of these. They will be cute. <laughs> Let's see. Save the retaining soil for later. Watering can. Save all of my ores and geodes. Sell all of these. I need to decide what to put in this awkward little area. Ooh, it might be cute to do like an apiary section up here. Because I have all of the flowers down here, so I could do like a row of beehives, a few more flowers, another row of beehives. That might be really cute. Right now I'm just trying to make sure I have enough wood because I don't fully remember how much wood is needed for a coop. The only way I remember anything from my challenge videos is writing them all down beforehand. I don't remember things. <laughs> I just kind of hope. Just show up and hope. Coffee. 
Oh, do I have a place planned for a coop? Need to make sure of that. Let's see. I'm putting all of my garden up there and my orchard over there. So maybe I put a coop down here. Yeah, I can do like my farm animals down in this area around this pond. Unfortunately, there's a lot of things I can't clear out yet. So maybe I will put the coop like right here or on the other side equal to it. Oops, I almost knocked over my tea. Yeah, I'll clear out a section right here and then go get a coop and put it. Because those don't need that much space. They just need some clear space. Yeah, and then I can put some cute fences down around this corner to keep all of the animals in. And there will be plenty of space for grass to grow, but not get near my crops. That sounds good. Eat some mushrooms so I don't faint again. no idea that you could continue using a tool for some amount of time before you painted. I thought you painted immediately if you kept using one. Did any of you know that? Also, do you have any idea how many it is? Because I got a good number of hits in. Maybe five? I'm not sure. That's brand new to me. Okay, that looks like a good space for a coop. I'll have to connect it to the rest of the farm at some point. But for now, little chickens can just wander around on their own, have plenty of space. walked into her. <laughs> yes, I do need something built. Success. Anyway, hi Robin, how are you doing? Yes, I met your son. Okay then, Demetrius. Not going to touch that. Nope. You can deal with that on your own. Ooh, wormy dudes. Can always use coal. Let's go foraging now, I think. I always hate checking that side for forage, but I found a ton of forage there a few times, so now I feel required to check it every single time, even though I know there's probably nothing over there. I'm not going to destroy your tent, Linus. I'm sorry. Oh, 
Can't give him a mushroom. Oh well. give Maru a flower. I don't think I've given her anything recently. I also don't know if she likes them, but flowers are cute. I like them. <laughs> Does anybody actually memorize gift tastes or like check the wiki? Because I never do. And then I'm like, why don't they like this thing I've given them? I could check the wiki or, you know, the little tab with their past gifts and likes and dislikes that I never, ever do. It's more fun to just be chaotic. Speaking of chaotic, I apparently can't walk. Hi, Judy. Hi, Caroline. Would you like a flower? The answer is yes, apparently. Hi, Alex. Have fun with your push ups. I hope. Hi, Evelyn. Have a flower. A flower and a little complaint about your husband. Here. I like that they're, they won't let you talk to them if they're dancing. It's very sweet. You're never going to win, Sam. Mushroom, Leah. Yes. Agreed, Emily. Jewel tones are better than pastels. Controversial opinions. Trash bread.
a cutscene. I like how his is a beer can and mine is just my normal default cup for everything. Do I just carry one cup around? I feel bad for Shane. That one's actually one of my favorite cutscenes because it's just like starting to open up to someone, but not enough for you to do anything. Plus I think it's funny how awkward you are in it. Standing there in silence, listening and then chugging a drink to avoid talking. Got to get my spring onions before it stops being spring. I don't care what the game calls them. They are spring onions to me. I'm sure somebody watching this is going to point out all of the forage I missed. But you know what? It happens. I can't even work out where the weeds are. Why do you think I can see the forage? <laughs> I don't know why I keep trying to go foraging at night when I can't see anything. Tomorrow, I need to build out paths on my farm down to the lower entrance. Ooh, level three mining. Okay. And forage, level four foraging. But I think next I need to build out paths down to all the different entrances of my farm because it's always so awkward going down through the bottom path. Having to fight around different weeds and rocks and branches. But it'd also just be nice to have the whole shape of my farm set before I get chickens. Another bad luck day. Oh, that's a cute letter.
I am going to pick these tulips because they aren't in the massive set of tulips. And I like having flowers to give out. Put my watering can away, get some stone, and then let's work on some paths. Do I have any extra paths right now? Nope. Okay. Let's see. Just going to get a ton of them. I think I would like to go this way. I'll put a gate right here and then that whole section could be for animals. So. Pathing to here. Ooh, and then down here I can put like a nice little border of something. I wanted to go up this far so that it would be like a little place to go fishing to. Did not mean to do that. Okay. Now where would be a natural place to connect up here? I can't go straight right now because of that, but I could just put it there and then plan to put some more. Ooh, and then that would line up with here. That's a good idea. So, start by just doing one, and then eventually I will put the second row down. I mostly just want to have it all marked out at once, you know? Ooh, I can get rid of these thumps. Good. I always mix up whether it's the stumps or the fallen trees you can get rid of with the copper axe. Okay, so getting rid of obstacles. Just keep placing pads. Yeah, that'll line up super nicely. Then we can start down here. And I need to get some more stone. But even just having the one row of paths will help with getting around.
Gotta eat my trash bread. I should really just go buy some food from Gus. I was looking at recipes last night and then I remembered I don't currently have a kitchen. But I should really just buy some food so I stop running out of energy. It's not like I'm trying to be careful with my money right now. I say spending an entire day getting materials to build a path around my farm instead of something more productive. Let's see. I think I have enough stone now. Oh yeah, that's nice. Okay, I like that. Save my paths for the next time I want to do a cute design. Let's make some of those nature bars or whatever. Field snacks. My brain was combining granola bars and like nature's own, if you know that brand, because they look like it. They look like they'd crumble all over and you'd never get it off. If you aren't familiar, it's a brand of granola bar that's very dry and oat heavy. So once you start eating it and it starts getting everywhere, it, it, it stays everywhere. Let's go give out some flowers. Hi, Haley, you like flowers, don't you? Here's one. Jody, have a toilet. I love flowers. Once I go, once I finish recording, I'm going to go shopping and buy some. Let's see. Marnie, have a flower. I don't know if Vincent will like this. Okay, cool. 
Everybody likes flowers. Yes, I do smell like grass. Don't eat the tulip. Oh, little heart. I'm glad she likes it. Found the person who doesn't like flowers. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Hmm. Let's buy a whole bunch of salad. And also one pizza to give to Shane. I feel like he deserves it after the heart to heart. <laughs> Haven't I been rude to you enough? Uh a lovely response to a present. Oh, there's a quest. Wild horseradish. I will see if I can get some tomorrow. Horseradish is a hard word to say. My jam. Sell some jam. Let's see. Actually, I haven't checked what I'm what I've done for the community center recently. answer is very little, but oh well. Maybe we should go fishing tomorrow. That could be fun. Hi, hey, coffee. You're so cute. Another bad luck day. Wow. I don't need to water the plants because it's the last day of the season. And I will leave all of these for now and then pick them tonight. Hi, coffee. Rooms.
let's take anything that I have for the community center over and then spend the day fishing. Try to make some money before the season changes. So, community center bundles. I think it's all just basic bundles. I think I might only have fish and some rocks for the community center bundles, but oh well. I have time. Yeah, I think that's it. Chop these off and go fishing. Let's also go foraging quickly first to see if I can get something for Sam. There's normally a ton of horseradish. Any cute hats? Not yet. Oh well. A straw hat is still appropriate for the spring. Ooh, traveling merchant. I should not spend all of my money on the rare seed. Oh well.
Let's see, drop off my fish. And I can do it in order. Yeah. Can't do this one in order, but oh well. And then my foraging. Quote unquote foraging because I just picked it up. Wait, this is crops. Oops. This way. Foraging. Because I have mushrooms. Okay, and then all of my different rocks. Shiny rocks. Grab the wrong number of bat wings. Oops. Okay. Half the shiny rocks. And one metal bar. Not enough to finish anything, but enough to start them. And free up space in my chests. Sorry, Sam, doesn't seem like you get any horseradish. You probably should have just gone outside and picked it when there were a ton of all over the ground. Because there were a ton. Oh, Harvey. I don't normally see Harvey. Because why would I go in the clinic? Hey, Vincent. Now, fishing time. I wish I could like fishing in this game more because I really like the mini game actually, but I just can't watch the motion of the water. It messes with my eyes. So I have to look away and then only look back when I get the alert. Is 
So like, it's okay. I like the mini game itself. It just gets really boring and there's no way to turn off the motion of the water. I know a lot of people dislike it, but it really is one of my favorite mini games. I think it's a nice mixture of challenging and interesting. Well, not interesting. Challenging and straightforward. It's way better than that Simon Says one with the crystals on Ginger Island. It's... But it's also not easy, you know? And I like that. So much seaweed. Okay, that's enough ocean fishing. Let's go back to a river. This is my favorite spot to fish. <laughs> it's so close to everything else. Plus, I don't have to struggle to get my fishing rod exactly in the center of the water. I don't know, do you have any favorite spots to fish? Mine is this one, obviously. In the corner of those two bridges in the forest. And then all the way at the end of the second pier on the beach. Even though there I constantly get the legendary fish instead of anything normal. I didn't mean for them to become my favorite spots, but I just always end up there. And then fishing anywhere else feels wrong. Ooh, 
treasure. Coal. Oh well. Never been nothing. That's rude, Clint. It's midnight. Don't ask me if I have work to do. Let's see. Sell all of these dudes. back get a copper bar going I need to organize all of this That's better. Now let's pick all of these so that I don't lose them entirely. And tomorrow I will get another crop of plants to put out here. Another crop of flowers, as well as all of my other plants. It's a bummer not all of them grew fully, but I'm glad as many grew as they- I'm glad this many grew. Oh, Cluffy's so cute. What was that sound for? Ah, my coop. I love the summer music. Fall is my favorite season, but the summer music is great. Okay. I did not mean to do any of that. <laughs> okay, let's get rid of all of the dead plants. Get 
get rid of the awkward piece of wood that generated. I didn't mean to do that. Fix my awkward mistake. And then let's go buy a ton of plants. I'm so excited. I love buying new plants. I have one, nine, another nine. Okay. So I have enough for this square and this square. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine sets of nine needed. I'm going to save all of the ones that have a whole bunch of that color and then go sell the rest. Oh, I should sell them at piers in person so that I can get the money back. Farming time! Yes! I really just love farming in this game. It's my favorite thing to do. That's why it's always awkward to start a video with the end of the season because I can't do my favorite things. George wants flounder. Oh, they aren't open yet. Okay. How about some nice foraging while I wait? Foraging in trash cans first, as you do. Okay, I can buy seeds now. That's enough moving around. <laughs> My very half-hearted attempt at foraging. But I will drop off some of what I got so that I don't sell it by accident. Even though this means it can't be in order. Oh well. But it seeds time. Sell all of these first, and then, let's see, let's start by buying the things that will continue to produce, so, nine blueberries, nine tomatoes, nine peppers, Nine hops, even though I will have to split them up. Nine corn. Okay, now what else do I want to get? Flowers. I want to get flowers so that I can start growing my entire field of them. Sunflower seeds would be nice. But spangle seeds are so much cheaper. Hmm. I'll get a whole bunch of spangle seeds right now and then fill the rest in with sunflowers once I have money. Great. Hi, Marnie. 
Gus. Pierre. Setting time. Well, really, digging a whole bunch of holes time. And then I get to plant. Let's start with the corn, because that's going to just stay here for a while. And then let's do melon. And... Oh, cauliflower are spring. Right, I forgot. I misread that. Okay. So let's do blueberry next. And then some tomato. And peppers right here. And then I can split my hops between here. Not the button I meant to hit. Here and next to it. And then my one star fruit seed can go in the middle of the hops. And my spangles flowers can start to go up here. I'm not going to put them in in any sort of an order, even though it's going to end up annoying when they grow at different rates, just because I would like to eventually have all of my flowers be, you know, mixed together. Instead of just an even patch of each. I think it'll end up looking better. Let's see. This will be interesting to water. But I think it'll end up looking nice. Eventually. Very far into the future. <laughs> I'm being dramatic. It'll look nice soon. Now to have a snack, so I can keep watering. Coffee, there's something there, you can't keep running into it. I appreciate your enthusiasm. 
you are going to break through a solid scarecrow. Aha! Finish. Now to eat a salad or two. And let's set up some fences so that I can get animals as soon as I have the money. I also need to get more seeds, but I need money for that. So let's just start with fences. Work our way out. Hmm, what are my fence options? So which one's cutest? Hardwood fence, iron fence, stone fence, or wood fence? A stone fence would probably look really good on this farm. It's also harder for me to get stone. But it would coordinate with the path so well. Hmm. I'll do wood right now because that's what I can easily get just on my farm. And then we'll see. Maybe we'll replace it with some stone later. start with 50. See how far that takes us. Oh, I also need to make a two gates. One for down here and one for up on the other side. Clear that out. Put down the gate. And the fence posts. And now this side is done. It was very hard, obviously. And let's... Ooh, what's the even spacing? Is this one even? No, it needs to be one over. Okay. So. Here. those out and then here and then why don't we cut across here I want to make sure my animals have plenty of space but I also don't want to take up too much space that could go to the rest of the farm let's see Clear out this way. 
And there will have to be a few points where it's not finished right now, but it's not like the animals will be able to get out of this. The attempts to get around obstacles. Excellent. Now I just need to work out where to put the gate. Maybe I should do one up here. If I can get around. I could do one like over here. Or I could have it all be on this side. I think I'd rather have it all be on this side. So why don't I do a gate right there? There. That'll be cute. Easy to connect up to the path. I actually think I'm going to sell some more of these tulips so that I can have some more money. I really need to get more plants and to be able to afford my chickens. Not bad. Not bad. Hey, finally a good luck day. It's been a while since we had one. Struggling. Just a little bit. all of the butterflies in summer.
Wow. Let's go buy some chickens and do some foraging. I like summer, but it's also probably my least favorite season. There's just not very much to do, but there's also not very interesting foraging. And today's Marnie's day off. Okay, no chickens, just foraging. Foraging and buying some more plants. Stardew Valley is bleeding over into my actual life. I just bought six new plants. I only have so many places to put them in my apartment, and yet it didn't stop me. Alex's life problems are so funny. You insulted me, have a flower.
A squirrel! So cute. No grapes. Oh well. I tried. I will just have to wait for that bundle. It's not really my main goal here anyway. Demetrius. Yes, I know I need to water my plants every day. Thank you. Plant sign. Not that I can get many, but I can get some. And those some are worth it. Did I walk in just slightly too late? Closed on Wednesdays, yes, but are you open right now? I thought it was until six. I love their little exercise club, it's so sweet. It makes it seem a lot more fun. So I guess I can't get seeds today either because I took slightly too long. Um. Maybe I will do some fishing then. Tricky fish. Oh, a pike. Cool. Thank <laughs> you. 
I think I have time for one more fish. That didn't take long. Maybe two more. An omelet. Trash omelet. <laughs> I do really love the little fireflies. They're so cute. I like that they're just one glowing pixel. But do you really need more to make a firefly off you? Yes, a lot of the time they look like that in real life. Level six fishing. Yes. <laughs> An earthquake during the night. Very dramatic. Okay, neutral is good. After the streak of bad luck days, I will take neutral. <laughs> Gotta get Mayor Lewis's short. It's one of my favorite quests. It's so, so silly. I've never put them in the luau. Should we keep them and put them in the luau? That could be some fun mischief. I normally just want the reward money and nothing else to do with the shorts ever, please. But we definitely have money for chickens and crops now. 
So let's go do that once I finish watering. Actually, this time. Coffee's so cute. I gave Coffee a really good name considering how much energy he, he has. Like, I could never. What should the naming theme be this time? It's a brown chicken, and my dog's name is Coffee. So maybe I will name all of my animals different drinks. So my brown chicken can be Coco. And I'm going to buy another chicken so that they aren't alone. So my white chicken. Hmm. What's a good name for a white chicken? A good drink. I'll just stick with the classics right now and do tea. White tea is a thing, you know. Anyway, hi Marnie, nice to see you. I'm not allowed to enter your room yet. Let's do a little bit of foraging and then go get some more plants before I um, miss it again. And let the chickens out, of course. Can't leave them trapped inside all day. That would be mean. Chicky, there's one. 
And there's two. They're so cute. So little. I will have to clean up their area of the farm once I finish my getting my other plants. It's not fair to leave them amongst so many sticks. It's like all sticks. And that just seems mean. They're smaller than the sticks. A grape! Yes, I can go finish that bundle. Finish the bundle. Buy some more plants. They'll be great. And now I have access to the train station. Wormy dudes? Ooh, a warp totem. I like getting warp totems. I almost never make them because it just ends up feeling like a waste. But whenever I get them for free, love it. Summer foraging bundle complete. And now I have a bunch more seeds. Hi, little Junimos, you're so cute. Harvey being a doctor, giving random doctory advice. <laughs> Pierce is closed on Wednesdays, I forgot. You know what? I really want seeds. I'm going to Joja. interesting mixture of things that are more and less expensive. The sunflower seeds are 75 less, but the spangle are way more. Huh. Interesting. Well, I guess I'm getting sunflower seeds because they're slightly cheaper than normal. Not that I can afford much. Ooh, 
a spice berry out of the trash. Sure. I'll take it. And let's do a bit more fishing because I do need money pretty badly. Plus, the wizard wants a sunfish. Treasure. Love treasure. And a sunfish. Aquamarine. Oh, come on. 
This fish, man. He's really decide, no, you're not going to catch me. There, thank you. I think that's enough fishing. Let's go sell all of these off, except for the sunfish for the wizard. And get some sleep. Oh, sell all of these off. Plant all of my new things. And then sleep. I got another sunfish. I didn't need to go fishing after all. Oh well. So, sell so those and those and those and that and that and that and that and those and then planting some things. Oh, have to dig some holes too. I need my watering can. I always feel so forgetful in this game. I'd say I'm not actually this forgetful, but I really am. It just comes out more when I'm also trying to record. Let's see. Refill my watering can for tomorrow and let's get bed. The spreading weeds have caused damage. Oh no. Bad luck again. This is just full of bad luck. Oh, sashimi. Okay, watering all of my plants. Dropping off the sunfish, and then let's go buy some more flowers. And also five more crops so that I can fill up the last of these sections, because it's mildly annoying me. Plus I should start growing some wheat.
I predict that accidentally picking a flower when I was trying to water the one next to it is going to become a major problem. <laughs> Oopsies. Ooh, a chanterelle. Go check up on my chicks. Then to drop off the sunfish. Rasmodius, I have your fish. I'm glad it was satisfactory. So formal. I do really like how the magical elements of Stardew Valley are just kind of there in the background. They aren't like the focus at all. They're just kind of there. You live in a magical world. You go give different items to magical creatures that will rebuild a community center and do nice things for you. This is normal. You buy hats from a mouse. Great sense in fashion. Can't believe the mouse is so good at making hats for people. I do really love the summer music. It's so upbeat and happy. It's also the one that gets stuck in my head. Okay. Seeds. I am sell selling my omelet. I got it for free. I don't have to keep it. Okay. I'd like a few more sunflower seeds, but they're very expensive. So let's start with some poppy seeds. Some poppies. I'll buy two more sunflower seeds. And then let's get hmm. Five radishes to fill up those empty spaces. And then for the other set of nine. Can I afford nine more? I can't afford nine more melon. So let's do Actually, let's do another set of blueberry plants. No, let's do another set of tomato plants because those are useful. Oh, I can't afford another set of tomato plants. Oops. Oopsies. Oh well. I will just have a, another unfinished section. Unless I can go forage enough. I might be able to forage some things. I'm not great at math, as you can tell. Hey, Haley. 
Thank you for starting to be nice to me. Oh, a cutscene. Ugh, seven weeks. He gets so happy about you fishing. It's really sweet. in the trash can, as you would expect. I've never gotten the garbage hat before. Oh yeah, I've never gotten this. Excellent. This is going to be my Halloween costume, I think. I'm going to go to the, uh, what's the name? I'm going to go to Spirit's Eve as a garbage can. <laughs> That's so exciting. I look so silly, but I'm going to commit to it. This is my hat now. It's perfectly normal, as you can see. Who wouldn't wear a garbage can as a hat? Sun protection, protection from all of those crows that try to eat my crops. You know, as you do. I'm going to wait until tomorrow to plant the tomatoes and go buy five more once I can afford them. And then it'll all be even. Yeah, that's a good idea. Okay, I need to dig some more holes so that I can put them all throughout the space. sunflower seeds so let's put one up there and one down here and then just start placing them
It looks so silly. I love it so much. Okay, I'm going to make the decision to sell more of my tulips so that I can actually have more money. Because I'm kind of low. Just, just a little bit. Just, just a little bit low. Okay, now let's clear out the space so my animals have a nice place to live. Because they don't deserve to be fighting rocks in order to exist. You know? Let's also clear a path to them. I must be so healthy eating salads all the time. And hungry. All of this backbreaking farm work and I'm just eating salads. I'll get a kitchen soon. Yeah, I think once my summer farm is all set, my goal should be a kitchen. Upgrade the house. And then I can start decorating my house properly. Another salad. Oops. I really need to get some lights back here, too, for the animals. Plus for me to make it easier to get back here. I'm going to drop a tree into my coop. Good thing we don't have structural damage in Stardew. Eat even more salad. And I think it's bedtime, if I can get out. <laughs> I cleared up a decent amount of this area. Ooh, I could 
could do a little um, tree farm around that entrance. That would be very cute. Perfect size for it. Ooh, I need to sell my jam. Jelly. Sorry. Even though I didn't strain anything, so it should be jam. It's jam to me. Great. I can now afford to go buy things. The constant struggle this time. I want to make a cute farm, but I can't afford a cute farm because I've been focusing on making a cute farm instead of a functional farm. Thank you for the fertilizer, J Jody. I'm going to put it for my tomatoes. Tomatoes group two. I'm also watering the ground for the tomatoes before I buy the rest of them so that I don't have to do it later. But I think we're almost to the point of getting our first crop. The peppers are looking pretty grown. One or two more days. Got to eat a salad to finish my watering. The real sign your garden is getting large. You have to eat in order to finish. One more watering can refill. And then, hmm, what, we, what should we do today? Obviously buy more crops. But then what else? It's a neutral luck day, so why don't we go to the mines? Try to get through those dark floors to get to the actually nice ones. <laughs> I really don't like the dark floors. Let's go buy some more seeds. Do some more planting. Go mining. A grape.
Clint wants copper ores. Okay. I'm going to the mines anyway. Okay. Five more tomatoes, so now I have a nice little nine of more tomatoes. Let's get... Let's start growing some wheat. Eighteen for two more nines. Great. Hi, Abigail. Well, now I have to clear out the spaces so that I can put the pads evenly. <laughs> and then I'll go to the mines. I need to make it look cute first. Looking cute is an essential part of having a farm. There's no... Okay. Oops. There. Now that's all cute. Put all of those away. Those away. Grab my... Very bad sword. And let's go to the mines. I have some food this time, so hopefully I will not die. Oh, I meant to grab more flowers too. Oh well, that can happen next time. I really hope the finished product with all the flowers scattered amongst each other will look cute. Most of them are multicolored flowers too. So that should help add to even more diversity. I just want it to look very differentiated instead of just one big mass of flower. Because it kind of is just one big mass of flower, but you know what I mean. Okay, let's try to get down to the ice levels. Topaz.
Water, please. Watch well, probably appeared and I just can't see it. But on the bright side, I'm getting more stone for my decorations. Eat a salad. Is it going to be the very last stone on this level? Are there even any stones left on this level? Make sure I kill the bat somewhere a ladder can appear. I just walked past it? Like, there has to be a ladder. Am I just not seeing it? Oh my god. It's been there the whole time. Oh, that's so rude. I didn't even see it in the end. I just walked into it and happened to be heading X. What was that sound? Ladder. Okay. Get down one more level and I will have an elevator. I'm not getting down to the ice levels today. But I can at least get part way through these levels. All I can see is the eyes. Yes. Oh. Ooh, immediately. And there's another one. Well, grab the topaz. I don't think we're getting any farther tonight, but nope. Definitely not getting further.
I can at least get some of this copper. Run. Run. Okay, that could have been a lot worse. I got a lot of copper. I'll have to drop by Clint's tomorrow and let him inspect it. Not my copper. <laughs> okay. Sold everything worth money. Put everything else away. And bedtime. Great. Let's go have a nice errands day, but try to buy the rest of the flowers needed for my little flower garden. Get Clint to open geodes, drop off, or show the copper to Clint to get approved, inspected, whatever word it is, <laughs> and see from there. Be so cute. I can't get over it. Sorry, coffee. I can't play with you right now. I'm trying to water all of my plants. I'm just going to stand here and count how many empty spaces there are for a second.
If I counted correctly, there's 49 empty spaces for flowers. Which is a lot, but hopefully I'll be able to buy enough. I'll probably buy 50 just to be safe if I miscounted. Oh. Let's go check on my chickies and then seats. Where are they? Are they inside, first of all? Eggs! I'm getting eggs now! They grew up. Okay. Hi, T. How are you? Um. And where is Coco? Hi, Coco! Thank you for the eggs. Okay. Piers. Garbage can hat looks so silly. Uh, it matches my earrings perfectly. Um, it just looks ridiculous. But I wanted another hat, so there you go. Sun protection. sunflowers a few more poppies and then just a bunch of spangle seeds it's still not enough but it's almost enough if I can finish a few quests that will be enough so let's go show the ores to Clint have to pick up the ores because I forgot them. And then Willy wants a rainbow trout. So let's see if we can do that. Copper ore. Oh. And my geodes. It takes so long to get across town without the minecarts or a horse. I always forget. Thank you. 
And Clint's is closed. Maybe I can catch him at the salon. And I don't have my water, a uh, fishing rod for a rainbow fish. Oopsies. <laughs> this was not very well planned. I got so distracted by counting how many flowers I needed. Yes, immediately a rainbow trout. What exactly did he want? Three. Okay. Can I get two more? Okay, that's... oh well. Let's go plant all of my seeds. We can buy the other things tomorrow. Ooh, a lucky lunch. I always find the best thing in this trash. Yes. One quest done. Still successful even if it went little bit different than planned. Have more things I can plant?
Okay, 28. So let's start just filling in from one side any empty spaces. And then it should be easier to add the rest. At least that's the theory. Oh yeah, there's not very much left to get. That'll be really easy to finish. I love how cute this entire garden is. The stone paths all around. Up here is definitely going to be perfect for a little apiary area. Idea of a little tree farm around the path to my animals. Sounds perfect. I'm so excited to do this. But unfortunately, I think we'll have to pick up with all of those in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed just hanging out with me, watching the sort of chill, a little bit silly and forgetful long play. Let me know what you think. Bye!